Kublai Khan was the fifth Khagan of the Mongol Empire. He was born in 1215 and died in 1294, reigning 1260 to 1294. He later founded the Yuan dynasty that resided in China and began in 1271. He was the fourth son of Tohuli and grandson of the great Genghis Khan. Kublai Khan was known and revered for his civilian and administrative, not his military achievements. He sought to govern rather than exploit and devastate his people. Generally, Kublai's overriding achievement is seen as re-establishing unity within China, a country that had been divided since the end of the Tang Dynasty, which ended in 901 AD. The major step taken in unity was the conquest of the Song Dynasty in the south, an accomplishment that took several years to achieve. Kublai Khan had earned the name Great Khan after a victory over his brother. His reign witnessed the Mongol Empire's most remarkable military success, the subjection of the Southern Song Dynasty of China and some simultaneously their greatest military fiascos. The failed naval expeditions against Japan were only the weather stopped the Mongols. But Kublai Khan was determined to go one more time, but his untimely death and his disagreements with his advisors had prevented him. The Yuan dynasty, which was founded by Kublai Khan, made a lasting impact on China through unification, technology and science, and increasing in trading and travelling with, within the West. Kublai Khan unified China, which enhanced its communication between different ethnic groups. Technologies, technologies in China advanced as in math and astronomy. This happened because of the open policy carried out by the Yuan rulers. Trading and travelling happened more often because of the external expansion of the early period of the Mongolian Empire.